Hello everyone, welcome back to the Tools of War channel. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment. Mikoyan Gurevich MiG-105 was a manned test vehicle to explore low-speed handling and landing. It was a visible result of a Soviet project to create an orbital space plane. This was originally conceived in response to the American X-20 Dinosaur military space project and may have been influenced by contemporary manned lifting body research being conducted by NASA's Flight Research Center in California. The MiG-105 was nicknamed Lapot, Russian, Lapot, or Bast Shoe. The word is also used as a slang for shoe, for the shape of its nose. Spiral 50, 50. The space plane and its liquid fuel booster stage mated to its hypersonic mothership carrier. The program was also known as EPOS, Russian acronym for Experimental Passenger Orbital Aircraft. Work on this project finally began in 1965, two years after Dinosaur's cancellation. The project was halted in 1969, to be briefly resurrected in 1974 in response to the U.S. Space Shuttle program. The test vehicle made its first subsonic free flight test in 1976, taking off under its own power from an old airstrip near Moscow. It was flown by pilot A.G. Festivets to the Zhukovsky Flight Test Center, a distance of 19 miles. Flight tests, totaling eight in all, continued sporadically until 1978. The actual space plane project was canceled when the decision was made to instead proceed with the Buran project. The MiG test vehicle itself still exists and is currently on display at the Monino Air Force Museum in Russia.